Hello and welcome to my newest video. Today I'm going to take a quick first look at Dragon King. As you can see here from the screen it's actually quite unique already because it doesn't really have the typical uh, first one pager information website but it actually has like a select screen so I can choose these different landscapes Fires of Fury, Classic and Hard Day's Night. You can also select the language. Maybe it's by a Korean developer, maybe an English developer who has close ties to Korean or to Korea. So what does it mean? So it's 24 hours so that seems like a harder landscape but it kind of gives you better value. Value, I'm sorry, <laughs> it's quite late here. Okay, let's just test out the easiest one, the classic one. It seems like has the best balance between those two criteria. Okay, it actually loads right now, okay. Let's see, loading I really like this art style right now. Looks really professional and fleshed out, in my opinion. Okay. Lock in. I can't. Oh, I can actually play with my, my MetaMask accounts. Okay. So I actually do have sound. Oh, it's a loud sound. So what can I do in this game? <laughs> Looks a little bit overwhelming right now. Never die coin, so that's their in-game currency I guess. So is it based on Ethereum? Is it running on the Ethereum blockchain? Keep your characters alive longer by using NDC to cast protection spells, okay? <laughs> do you have other players here? That's really cool actually. You have dragons, bat the bone. Okay, so you have dragons, your dragons, so I can purchase dragons. Should I just do this one? That's already five dollars. I don't know. <laughs> so I have these different rarities in dragons, and obviously the stronger they are, the more expensive they are as well. Rock breaker, grizzly green jaw. Okay. I can also buy balloons. My God. Promote with Dragon King, so I can promote my own game. <laughs> Look at this hit B BTC. That's really cool. <laughs> Actually, oh, that's really cool. Are they actually being controlled right now? Or are they just flying around automatically? Not quite sure. Oh, I can actually put in full screen. That's always nice. The next eruption will occur in about 11 hours. Okay. Is there any kind of information? Now oh, I can also buy knights. Master Swordsman, High Commander, Elite Guard. Oh, that's the Elite Guard I saw just there. Crusader, look at this. Ooh. <laughs> Take me through the journey. Rippin, Elite Guard, H9, value 0.1 Ethereum. Okay. So I can leave here. My tokens. Okay. Oh, this is the one I leave. Right? Oh, no, that's my wallet. Okay. But. Unfortunately. <laughs> oh, okay, lore. Oh my god, that's a lot of information. I'm not really going to read on the first look video right now. Rules, what the game about? Dragon King is a game based. I'm sorry, I have to turn down this music. Why was it again? No. Here. So. Do it like this. And then this. And. How to's, maybe? Oh, so that's just... Wait! Do all these dragons stand for different tokens? No, that's just because they have similar colors. I guess, right? Rules? Okay, what's the game about? Dragon King is a game based on Ethereum blockchain and allows you to win Ether with a combination of luck and skill. Players are allowed to purchase dragons or knights and have a chance to watch them survive in a fantasy world full of lava and fight till death. When the volcano erupts, so that's in 11 hours, and some of the dragons or knights get killed, the ether value is distributed to all remaining creatures in the world depending on their type. The longer the creatures survive before getting killed, the more ether they are worth. Okay. Also, each player is able to initiate a fight between one of its own creatures and a random creature of other players. The creatures fight and the winner takes the value of the loser. Oh, okay. 
that's really cool so it has kind of a control system but also has kind of randomized system so you kind of just own these different assets either dragons knights or even a balloon and oh look at this small balloon that's really cute <laughs> and um, you kind of might get unlucky or you get really lucky and you kind of increase the value of your of your character or your dragon or your knight if you want to call it that Dragon King is the first game powered by smartphones on the Tempong that fully utilizes NDC and TPD as they were designed to be used. The API mechanics that enables and is okay. Dragon King plays already the Dragon King is a trustless strategy game played entirely on the Ethereum blockchain. You have objectives to become the Dragon King and collect taxes from your Dragon job subjects. So I like the distribution I'm sorry, I like the distribution system whole kind of gamifying the, the, the cryptocurrency investment process, having a decent return on investment and also having some luck in it, some kind of gambling so to speak. Uh, also if you take higher risk you have a higher chance uh, to uh, get a decent amount back but you also have a higher risk obviously to lose it all. So yeah definitely an interesting idea and game and just the way it plays just is so unique and just so different from all the other crypto and blockchain games I have been doing videos on uh, def so that I can only give it a really high potential in my opinion. I think it has really great potential um, just by looking at it I really like the idea, I really like the uniqueness, I really like what they kind of implemented so far maybe it will later down the line also have a more more gameplay heavy um, kind of control system so to speak um, but yeah definitely check out Dragon King I really can um, recommend to anyone who's interested but as I always say this video is not meant to be financial advice so please don't take it as as financial advice and do make sure that you do your due diligence on tracking first before you invest and also make sure to only invest as much Ethereum as you can afford to lose. Um, hope you liked the video and please leave a comment below tell me what you think about Dragon King. I'm really interested in your opinion. Maybe you already played it, maybe you did play it before and you had a Dragon um, or a Dragon Knight or a Knight, I'm sorry, <laughs> it's actually called just a Knight and you lost it. What do you think about this game? Do you think it has some uniqueness to it? Do you think it has potential? Again, always appreciate your information that you provide in the comments below and it kind of helps the whole idea of having a healthy discussion and improving this whole blockchain game space. So yeah, again, hope you liked the video and I'll see you next time. Bye.